let's talk about the favorite preventative practice for men for prostate cancer. And what is that? Sex. There you go. Best item we ever ran in this. <laughs> men across the country cutting it out. The more you ejaculate, the lower your risk of prostate cancer. On refrigerators across the country, nightstands, you name it. What's the truth? The truth is that there is some truth to that based on a huge study, uh, a lot of puns in this conversation. Mm -hmm. uh, let's just cue them all now. Uh, <laughs> the huge study right. uh, looking at over uh, 30,000 men for about 10 years, mm -hmm. published uh, about a year ago, showing that men that ejaculate uh, at least 21 times a month, 21. average, average, and they started studying uh, the men, mm -hmm. the male group were from the age of, be, between the ages of 29 to the ages of, to their late 60s, mm -hmm. average 21 times a month had a lower risk of not only prostate cancer, but the, even the more aggressive type of prostate cancer. So 21 times a month, what do you do with that information? Well, clearly you know what to do with that information, but what if your partner is not into it, you have mm -hmm. the type of partner that's, there's no way they're gonna, you know. 21's a lot. It's a lot, it's a lot. So, and it didn't, so they didn't differentiate with partner. Right. They didn't, they didn't differentiate with partners, more than one, and they didn't, didn't differentiate with those that um, just took matters literally into their own hands and masturbated. Right. It was just it's ejaculating. It's just the use of the plumbing. Of the plumbing. Right. 21 times a month. So the, still a lot, mm -hmm. um, still a lot, uh, although some men would argue depends. against that. Depends <laughs> on your age, depends on your proclivities. Uh, on a lot of right. things. Uh, but that's what the studies mm -hmm. show um, with no clear indication as to why that is. And some theories include right. that, you know, um, a, about 70% of the semen is produced in the prostate. So if you don't let that out, it right. kind of clogs up the, the pipes, if you will. Right. There's also antimicrobial properties in semen and mm -hmm. sperm. So when a man ejaculate, they're literally cleaning out the pipes right. as they ejaculate or when they ejaculate. There's all of those other factors uh, that that are probably the reason why. Uh, but that's, I'm just the messenger. All right, it's a good message to say. All right, best, probably the best video we've ever done. Men, <laughs> get on it. <laughs> literally. <laughs> Let on. <laughs> all right. Thanks, Dr. Gio. You're welcome. If you liked what you just saw, we have a whole lot more with Dr. Gio Espinoza at our website, bottomlineinc.com. And do me a favor, share this, tell your friends. We have so much great information. Come to bottomlineinc.com.